Oh, oops. Hello, everybody. Welcome. Er, oh gosh, we haven't even said welcome to the Himon channel once on these new videos. <laughs> we... <laughs> well, probably because I'm like, because it's a spinoff of my original Welcome to the Pie Factory intro, which I haven't said in uh. years. Um... But, I mean, welcome to the Hitmon channel. We're your tour guides, Noah. And Jacob, and if it makes you feel any better, Noah, I've definitely had to restrain myself from saying welcome to the Pie Factory just out of habit. You never had to say that, though. <laughs> no, but I was used to associating it with starting a video. But you never started Well, I never conducted the habit. It got stuck in my mind. <laughs> That's like... That's like Ross saying, welcome back to Game Grumps, <laughs> which <laughs> he was never on Game Grumps, well, except for the later Super Mario Maker 2 oh. videos, but, um... That being said, I, being said, I, I was said for these recent videos, I'm 100% sure I have made that mistake in a much earlier video, that I, like, way back that I intro that you definitely called me out for at the time. Probably. I have the steep memory if you give me shit for that. <laughs> yeah. uh, and now I, I usually just, I mean, now I usually just start, I'm, I'm just so used to starting videos with Hey Guys, which I did before it was beneficial to the algorithm. <laughs> I had. <laughs> for, for those who haven't heard, um... As um, one of my favorite YouTubers, uh, Duncan Knee Deep, has endlessly um, uh, criticized YouTube for, um, the algorithm apparently actually pushes videos that specifically say, um, hey guys, at the beginning. Which is really, really dumb. dumb. Yeah, it's really dumb. <laughs> A lot of like a lot of the other things that people give YouTube for is just like a potentially alright idea that they implement terribly, but that's just dumb. Bam. Alright. Yeah, so we're we're back with Ghost Rider, uh, starting on the level that we attempted on part zero. Um, uh, last episode was basically just catching, just redoing what we did in my original video that got deleted, and doing it better now that I, uh, am taking full advantage of the upgrade system. <laughs> uh, so, um, we, yep, um, and we're not too far away from having enough souls to unlock that Omega level Link combo, or whatever it is. Um, Link Charge, I think it is, actually. Which uh, will be really, really cool to have. Uh, and then, after that, we'll just go... We'll, we'll just keep going towards more combos, probably. Um, but yeah, hopefully we have a much better time on this level than we did in part zero, um, because I want to beat this game, uh, and it's not a super long game, I don't know exactly how many levels there are, but how long to beat.com says this game is like four or five hours. Oh, so, so you know what, I have a computer available with me, so set that up. Yeah, uh, so not, not very long at all. And, of course, how long to beat, like, well, obviously, like, me, for me, as, you know, this is a blind playthrough, um, it'll probably be closer to that four or five hour margin, if not longer, um, but, like, for example, it also said that Super Mario Sunshine took, like, 16 hours to beat, and Jacob beat it in less than seven, so... <laughs> Um, yeah, just making sure I am indeed recording. Um, yeah, um,
Uh, you know, while we're while we're while we're playing this game, oh, you know what? I I did want to check something quick. Uh, options. Sound setup. No. Oh, move list. Ah, there's all the combos. All right. Well, I mean, I just mash buttons, so whatever. <laughs> oh, there's a map. Okay. Well, I've checked a walkthrough for it, and I've learned that there's a level called the Danger Zone. So. Nice. <laughs> All right, back to game. <laughs> and it is appropriately a biking level. Yes, that's what I want to hear. <laughs> I just hope they don't actually play the song. As awesome as that would be, I would be worried about copyright. Yeah. Uh, and here, here's that that big that big bad again. Uh, fucking he! I mean, I'm a, I'm not wrong in saying he looks like Nemesis from Resident Evil Three, right? Uh fine to get a better look at him. Like this big red guy that I kept having trouble with in Part Zero. Uh, I, hmm, I ugh. More spiky. No, no, it might slimy. just be—it might just be my screen, but I don't quite see it. He, he, I mean, this one's more spiky, less slimy for sure, but like. Yeah. Also less decaying. Oh yes. Okay, that's that's good, yes. I'm just checking, yeah, there's no fire. Okay. Alright. Alright. Thirty levels. 30 levels. Okay, so we've done... This is f level 5. Oh. Oh. What is it? Alright, well. Oh, okay. I lost count of things again. For some reason, I thought we were on level 3. No. The, it's... Okay, so, well, in that case, yeah, that's a lot better time. This is the third, um, beat it. This is the third, um, like, standard beat em up level. I, ah, that's why. Yeah, so far it's been alternating between, uh, beat em up and, um, motorcycle, so. Which I'm guessing will probably continue. So, like, 15 of these beat em up levels, 15 motorcycle levels. I'm guessing. I don't know for a fact. Yeah, boom. Sorry if I'm a little absent for like I'm going to write through a couple of these episodes. I did buy an idea, and now I'm trying to figure out how loud, discipline wise, somebody needs to be to destroy a building. Okay. No worries. Uh, I did not bring. Do you want for context for that? Or <laughs> I, I, I'm sorry. I, I was kind of tuned into the game more so than you. What did you say? <laughs> I got distracted by something, and now I'm trying. I thought my idea, and now I'm trying to Google how, like, trying to Google how like loud something needs to be in terms of decibels to destroy a building. Oh, <laughs> are you writing a DC film? <laughs> no. No. No, I, I had an I, idea for a death battle came back into my head, and now part of me. Now I'm want to do a, try and do a quick check for how I could do a check of a calculation for something. Uh, what battle? Uh, you... I wouldn't know either of the characters? You do not know either of the characters. Okay. 
both from anime slash manga. So. Okay. Gotcha. For anyone in the audience for whom the names of Nosuke and Denji mean anything, and Nosuke versus Denji is the one that I'm trying to basically use the term. By the way, I'm I'm so fucking psyched for Danny Phantom versus Jake Long. Yeah. I could looking forward to that one. Yeah, I mean Danny Phantom. It's so weird because like people nowadays like praise Danny Phantom as one of the best Nicktoons, but like when I was a kid, nobody I knew watched that show. Really? Yeah. Like, I was the only one in my elementary school who ever watched that show. And I actually, I had my mom make me a custom Danny Phantom costume for Halloween one year. Because I loved it so much. It's I also really like Tack and the Power of Juju, but I could not have my mom make me a costume for that. <laughs> for obvious reasons. <laughs> what, what, I mean, the main re one being the lack of shirt. But also, that might... I don't know. Would that be culturally insensitive? Like, I, I'm not clear. Or at the very least, be close enough. Okay. Yeah, at the very least, be close enough that it isn't worth doing. But yeah. basically, if you need to ask whether or not something's co like culturally insensitive, it probably you're is. on the side of don't doing it. Yeah, well, yeah, because I don't know exactly what, uh, what ethnicity Tack is meant to be. I mean, his skin looks white, but I'm not sure. Hmm. <laughs> oh. You know, that's funny. I I actually... Well, I remember... Oh, yes, fire! Yes! Oh, good. I needed that. And we are officially past where we um, kept dying last time, so... We, yes, this is already going much better than the last playthrough. Yes. Oh, yes. Actually, let me check. Okay, not quite enough, but we can invest what we've got. 290 left until we're Omega level. Oh, it might. Well, that's not going to get us to Omega level, but. I like how there's just a bed here. I don't know why. I wish I wish there was a way for you to uh, like lie in the bed as Ghost Rider. Because <laughs> I mean, like in other video games, a bed is typically um, a healing you know, point. Hell, heals you up. Um, so it'd just be funny to see Ghost Rider just sleeping in a normal. Well. I mean, a normal, but slightly wrecked bed. A mildly on fire match. Mildly on fire. <laughs> yeah, you know, just, just mild, just mildly on fire. I'm not extreme or anything. He's not all dead, he's just mostly dead. There's a big difference between <laughs> mostly dead and all dead. That movie's on Disney Plus now, because it's a Fox movie. It, it's so weird to see that on Disney Plus. Because, yeah. I mean, it, it does feel, like, in line with Disney, like, fairy tales. Uh, but, like, it is also weird to see, like, a classic movie that is very much not originally made by Disney, now owned by Disney. Because, like, yeah. it didn't occur to me until it, um, until they announced it was coming to Disney+. Plus. I was like, oh yeah, that was Fox. 
I need to watch that movie again, actually. I've only actually seen it once. Um, but it's like, I mean, Liam's family, that's like their favorite movie ever. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and pen and stare. No, I might not need to. Oh, yeah, all right. That was good. Oh yeah, after, after I finish these enemies, we're upgrading to Omega level for that uh, Link charge. Yeah, we got enough. Let me just collect these last few. Can I collect you? What, what, what's the deal with the green ones? Okay, I guess they automatically get drawn to me, but okay. Um, yes. There, you go. there we go. Our link charge is now fully upgraded. Uh, what do we want to start putting? Eh. Yeah, let's increase the speed of the gouge. Alright. Alright. TNT. Ooh. Oh, this is going to be fun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Hell yeah! Did he light it? I, I'm pretty sure he lit it with his head, and that's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, and that's the end of the level. Oh my god. Oh, this is so much better. <laughs> this is so much better. Oh man. Thank god I practiced off screen and learned how to actually play this <laughs> game properly. Because this is making things a lot easier. And a lot more fun, too. Valley of Death. Holy shit. Oh, this is going to be fun. Probably difficult, but fun. Oh, whoops. Did not, uh... There we go. Oh, what? Why did I turn around there? Why did I turn around there? Did not mean to do that. Oh, shit. Did that too early. I'm still not great at this game, but I'm doing a lot better now that I know how to play it. Er. <laughs> or that I remember, because, like, I mean, if I had started the, if I had continued this playthrough, like, immediately after, uh, the, uh, original video, like, I, I, I would have been much better off. But, like, I mean, it's been four years. Yeah. So. Oh. There we go. Oh, shit. That turned. Oh, whoa. <laughs> okay. Bit of a glitch there. Going. Well, maybe not necessarily a glitch. But like, all right. Did I just get a Discord notification? Hang on. I definitely didn't. I'll have to check that later, <laughs> because I am currently uh, killing demons on a motorcycle. And on a motorcycle killing demons. The really, really ordering though, it doesn't matter which way you order those, because both are true. <laughs> Oh, 
cool that we... Oh, shit. I barely missed that. go and whoop there we go oh oh there's like alternate paths you can take it looks like in this one there we go on to the next segment I guess Lot of rumbling there. Woo, yeah, there we go. Woo, whoa, there we go. Oh yes, there we go. Woo, I'm I'm getting better at uh, reacting. Oh shit! <laughs> Need to say straight there. Okay, I survived some. Well, I guess I didn't fall off anything or fall into anything. So, ooh, ooh, that was close. Go. My finger slipped off of the gas for a little bit there. This is so fun. I, I'm sorry. I'm not. I'm not providing like any like meaningful commentary right now. Just cause I'm just having too much fun with this. This is. I mean, this is really like I. I'm having much more. In, I'm getting much more enjoyment out of this now that I am better at the game. Well, it's not even an improvement of skill, it's just a, a, an enhancement of knowledge that helped me uh, make the game easier. Although now I'm thinking, like, I'm having so much fun with this, uh, I'm thinking, after we beat the game, um... How, how about this? Um, since I originally played this game for Halloween, um, this coming Halloween, uh, we could do a bonus stream of this where I play with an invincibility cheat and I play as Blade. Alright, sounds good. Because I really want to play as Blade. <laughs> I, I, I love the... I mean... Like, that is definitely a playable character I did not expect. But then I saw it, and I was like, oh, that'd be co that's cool that you can do that. Because, like, it's unexpected, especially for, like, a, a movie tie-in game. Because they would have had to... Because... Because who owned the rights to Blade at this point? Movie Uh, movies. hold on. Okay. Because I'm assuming they would have had to do some deal with Or maybe because it's a video game, they were able to get away with it. I don't know. Since the video game rights, it probably be sep might be separate from the movie rights. But with the movie, although with the movie tie-in video game, it'd probably be a different story. Yeah, well, because we did see the Columbia logo, the Columbia Pictures logo at the beginning. So, like, they definitely had involvement. Um, but Blade wasn't Columbia. I don't think it was. Anyway, I think it was New Line Cinema. I th I think New Line Cinema did the Blade movies, the original Blade movies. 
Oh, I can absolutely upgrade some shit uh, after I'm done killing these guys with the waterfalls. Uh, here, let's upgrade some shit. Um, probably need to match a little bit of this. Spirit gauge, yeah. Yeah, let's max that out. Probably can. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, let's go for shotgun. Red hot level. And we just need, oh, a lot more to get that to white hot level. That's, ooh, that's nice. Yeah, we're gonna, we do have a lot more combos we can unlock in the future. And we've got all these, like, extra stuff to unlock, too. My guess is that they make it so that you will obtain enough souls throughout the game to unlock everything. My guess. That's my guess. Anyway. Ooh! We're fight fighting demons in an elevator shaft? <laughs> nice, nice. Not what I was expecting, but I, I'm, I'm here for it. Holy shit, my my fucking chain game, or whatever, like, look at that shit, like, every, I'm maxing out everything, and I, this is, yeah, this is gonna be fun. who owned the rights of Blade yet, but I have found out that in 2011 there was a Blade anime. Oh, I knew about that. Did you also know that there is, I believe, a CW live-action series that's apparently supposed to be connected to the movies, but it's also not the same cast at all? Uh, I found one on Spike TV. Spike TV, that's what it was. It wasn't CW. Well, I think it's on, like, the CW, like, online thing. Like, the uh. CW seed. I think I think you can, like, watch the episodes on there now. But yeah, I was aware of the Blade anime, too. They made a lot of Marvel anime, actually. I, I assume it's all the same guy. The, or the same people doing all the... I think. I don't know. Because there was an X-Men anime, too. Um, I'm trying to think if there was... What other ones there were. But yeah, there were a few different Marvel animes. Damn, oh, I slammed his head on the, on the elevator platform. Yeah, I'm going to do it again. Yeah, hell yeah. Oh, this is fun. I, I just cannot stress enough how much fun I'm having with this game now. You know, we had some struggles in part zero, but this is... This, this is fun.
This, I just realized, this is like a very tall elevator shaft. Because we were fighting dudes on there for a while. Like, how many stories is this apparently crystal cave? Alright. <laughs> I mean, I, I won't... I won't ask questions. Eh. Might as well put a little bit towards the shotgun. I wish that shotgun was not just like. I, I wish you actually pulled out like a legit shotgun. Okay, uh. Oh, is it boss time? Is this another boss? Okay, as far as I can tell, it was like the Blade rights were owned by New Line Cinema. Yeah, that's what I thought. So, technically by Warner. Oh, that's so weird. Yeah. That's so, I didn't even think about that. That's so weird. Well, cause, well, would if them, would they have been Warner at that point? Maybe New Line Cinema got bought by Warner later on. I don't know. Just, check. It just feels very weird to have, a, I guess you do pull out a shotgun. It, it just happened so quickly it didn't look like it at first. Oh, this guy's actually doing a number to me. This is probably a bit overkill, but probably a dude to... Yeah, there we go. If I did that sooner, it would have probably been better, but... What is this? Okay, the first Flip movie came out in 1998, but it seems that New Line was acquired by Warner in 1996, so two years prior. Oh. Also, you have absorbed the Earth soul. You can now destroy Earth magic. <laughs> right, yeah, because the henchmen were Earth themed, elemental themed, so I guess. Oh. Okay. I guess he killed the Earth guy. I guess. At some point or something. Um. Okay. Definitely a different setting. <laughs> Is that it for this area? Oh, I guess I just go back down. All right, that's a lot of vibrating. All right, I have no idea what the name of that guy is. Oh, and more enemies showing up. I guess that makes sense. Now, this better be the exact amount of distance I traveled up. Even if I don't defeat all the enemies by then. If it doesn't stop, then continue. I'm going to be on your ass for continuity. <laughs> but did you see the, the newest TV sins? On, on the, I have not. Uh, um, so they're now um, apparently... Um, Apparently, Rick and Morty episodes are new again, and huh. uh, after, uh, of course, another long break, um, and uh, they are going to uh, be sinning the episodes as they come out now, which is cool. Yeah, pen and stare. Just for, just for the hell of it. Eh, hell. I'm funny sometimes. <laughs> this is just, oh my god, I just, I, I don't know what it is about this game, but I'm just like, I'm, I'm having, like, like this is the most fun I've had playing a game in quite some time. Although, to be fair, it's also been quite some time since I've played a game. <laughs> so, by the way, your first statement is correct. Yeah. Uh, but, no, this is, this is, like, this was the perfect game for us to, like, start with for these, like, you know, this resurgence of us starting LPs again. Especially because, like, again, I didn't do 
a lot of the LPs to begin, like I didn't do a lot of the playing to begin with for our uh, COCOM LPs. Pretty much, apart from like our old, old co-ops that we never finished, has there ever been an LP besides Luigi's Mansion where I was playing? Except, I, well, we alternated, well, we alternated at first in Lights, Camera, Pants, but didn't at one point you just take over entirely? I can't remember on that. Yeah. Ooh, this, this looks like a job for combo. Yeah. Oh, wow. This guy is resilient. I say, as I kill him. <laughs> um. I guess we leave now? Ah, that was the end of the level. Okay. Cool. Oh, how long has this episode been? Oh yeah, we can go for another level or two. Save the game, yes. Determine that it is harder than you would think to determine how much damage disciples can do beyond destroy your eardrum level. Mm -hmm. When you try to Google it, all the sources just kind of stop there. Uh, did, didn't Mythbusters do a thing with, like, the... Well, it's not popping up, but they did. Well, not necessarily with, like, destroying buildings with sound, but, like, the, like, um, didn't they do a thing with, um, the, uh, fuck, what was it? Um, uh, I have no idea. Uh, The hell cycle is infused with the Earth Soul. You can now perform a double Hellfire jump by pressing X twice. Oh, okay. I'm guessing I'm going to need to do that often. And I'm probably going to forget sometimes. <laughs> That's fine. Oh, wow. That time I actually just rammed into a wall so hard I died. That hasn't happened before. Or not the side walls, anyway. Oh, shit. Too late. Shit, barely. Oh, shit. I'm definitely uh, better at the beat-em-up segments than the motorcycle segments, but the motorcycle segments are still really fun. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, okay. I that okay. I thought I thought I was going to die there. <laughs> Because I hit the ceiling, I thought I was going to fall to my death because of it, but no. I'm good.
Getting a lot of vibrations here. Go. Oh, minecart. Whoa, sudden minecart. And I died because I crashed into it. Gotta watch out for mine. Of of all the things I was expect. Oh wait, no, that's not a minecart. That's a fucking train. Oh no, that's the minecart that kills me. <laughs> Never mind. Oh, yeah, there we go. Next segment. Oh. Whoa. Oh. Okay. Again, thought I was going to die because I hit the ceiling, but now nah, I'm good. Oh, that time I died hitting the ceiling, though. Alright, a little bit of inconsistency, but that's fine. You know, what's life without a little spontaneity? Just don't say yes to everything. That's a, that's a yes man joke for those uh, who uh, don't uh, listen to the podcast. If you want to get more uh, hot tasty movie references like that don't know why I phrased it like that um check <laughs> out our podcast no lights no camera action over on my main channel and on anchor and spotify if you want to listen to it uh anchor and spotify is the better option because uh well at least on anchor we could potentially make money off of it and you don't have to worry you can listen to it anywhere uh like, you don't have to worry about, like, keeping your phone open for uh, a YouTube video. You can just, you know, listen to it in the car. You can listen to it in the shower. Um, uh, how, how about every, anyone who is watching this video that uh, listens to the podcast... Uh, let me know the weirdest place you've listened to our podcast in the comments below. <laughs> oh, I, yeah, no, I need to time the double jump better. Oh, no, I turned around again. Shit, 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 shit. Oh... Okay. Oh God. Oh. Ooh, ooh. A little. Oh Jesus Christ. Okay. Yeah. The one issue I foresee with the future of this series is that the motorcycle levels are getting steadily harder. But, um, my upgrades don't really help me on the motorcycle segments. So, oh, I did that too late, apparently. I thought I did it in time, but I don't know. Oh, what? Oh, okay. I gotta do it real early, I guess. But not too early, otherwise I'll come out of it too quickly. There we go. Wait, what? Oh, did I need to take that ramp? That very small ramp? Oh, yes, apparently I did. Ooh, oh, nope, I missed that. Oh, <laughs> my dead body just, like, stuck to the wall. <laughs> that was funny. Oh, and not a good landing, I guess. Okay. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. Like, these motorcycle segments are getting harder, but I am not getting better at the motorcycle segments, and the upgrades aren't helping me <laughs> in the motorcycle segments. So that is the one issue I foresee with the future of the series. But, I mean, they are pretty forgiving on the motorcycle segments for the most part. Um, but, uh, yeah, hopefully that doesn't become a huge issue for us. Um...
I'm all, I also keep forgetting about the, the, the fire I can shoot. I don't know why I'm forgetting about that. It's the most effective way to handle enemies because you can get them from very far away. Come on, damn it, I thought I made that. All right, there we go. All right, there we go. Uh, yeah, I think that'll that'll be it for this episode. Uh, I'm go I'm going a little shorter than hour long for these episodes, but I mean we are um we're we're making pretty good progress in in the game. Uh, you wanna uh you wanna check for me um what numbered level, uh, what number of level back to the surface is, because I lost track. Hello? You still there? Yep, just looking it up. Oh, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Alright. Wait. You there? Yeah, I'm here. Wait, what did you say? It was level eight. Okay. Oh. Shit. Oh, wait. Never mind. We're so we're about uh, uh almost a third of the way through. Yeah. That that is very very nice. All right. Um, well, yeah, that's that's gonna be it for this episode. Uh, I I hope you guys enjoyed, cause I sure as hell am enjoying this. Uh, <laughs> I, I'm Noah. And that's Jacob. I'm guessing he didn't hear me say. And I'm Noah. What was that? Yeah, yeah you. Uh, sorry. No, it's I'm Jacob. Peace. Yes.